morning. Yeah. Uh, um, you and I look at the result last time we went uh, in La Madame du Tel. You were there. Yeah. <laughs> do, you re do you remember it? I was uh, a long time ago, eh? but <laughs> yeah, I remember. It's quite a hard climb, long climb. And yes, the uh, uh, gradient average is almost the same. Every every time is six percent more or less, and with a lot of uh, corners. And yeah, uh, I'm not in the same shape like uh, that year for sure. But uh, we can uh, do uh, different things, no? Um, with that steady gradient, who do you think is favorite the most among the the GC favorites? Is more for Emco? Is more for Sielmos? Oh, you, I don't know. It's uh, completely different, uh, for sure, from the last uh, stages, last uh, climbs. It's longer, but uh, yeah, I think it's more for uh, climbers like yeah Bernal or Witrego or also Skelmos, uh, Felix Gal, uh, Renko. All the GC guys, for sure, they are in good shape. Otherwise, they will mean they will not uh, dare. And yeah, it will be nice to see how they do it uh, in the last climb. And for you, what is the plan then? Uh, for me, uh, I'm sure that I don't have any chance uh, with the GC guys, so I will uh, try to to take uh, like uh, breakaways, like today or tomorrow, and uh, to make something different. Is there a chance for a breakaway today? Yeah, it's not going to be easy for sure. It's short stage, uh, also today, also tomorrow. And there are also, like I said the uh, other day, uh, some guys in the GC, uh, they lose a lot of time and maybe they have also strong teams to, to pull all the day and to, to keep the distance uh, for the breakaway. But uh, we don't have nothing to lose, so we, we try it. Thank you, Jan. Thank Best you. of luck, Masade.